It's been quite a long time since I took the time to reflect on the reason I keep doing it. But I guess we all have our own things. I've never thought of memories to be something we need to be afraid of. But in a sense, you're right. I gotta admit. I've always been scared of many things. I feel like every time I have to do something, I'm scared, actually. So I keep having these pictures in my head. Pictures of moments, memories that come back, and they keep asking me for something. But they're so vague, and rarely involve people I know. It's more like pictures that force me to take a step back. I feel like there is a schema. I can't really explain it. But all these memories have something in common. Even if I was looking up, or down, or far ahead. Don't you feel it? Maybe it is because I feel small. Or is it the opposite? Do I feel like a giant? People always tell you that in art, scale and perspective are important. But honestly, I've been more worried about scale and perspective in my own life rather than in my art. What do I want to achieve? Where do I want to go? Somewhere quiet. Somewhere busy. Ocean. Mountains. At some point, I don't even know if these pictures are memories from the past or projections of what I want to see in the future. Will I live here? Have I lived here? I believe I'm living here. But once again, when I'm working, I'm not even sure about it. And sometimes I see people all unrecognizable, but at least I'm not alone anymore. Like here, which honestly doesn't happen that often in my memories. So, yeah, this is why I paint all these memories. I get less afraid of them in the end. I can see their beauty and be thankful for still having them around.